I wanted to write a play about people taking from each other and why they need what it is that they take and what they're driven to if what they need is withheld. And I, and I really wanted to push that as far as I possibly could. It's a film noir with, instead of a femme fatale, a homme fatale. And he does a great job filling the set with sexual energy. You will want to be him, just like everybody wants to be the femme fatale on some level. To Burn is about that passion, that irrepressible, undeniable passion that compels people to express their true nature. The man being seduced by a younger man and uh, a very self-aware and, and powerful younger man. It is about how people come together to get ahead. It's about ambition. It's unexpected and exciting, maybe even a little bit messy. There is a lot of exciting sexual tension. There's no question about that. Elixir Productions was founded in 1998 by Alex DeFazio and myself, and we've had a working relationship for 13 years. The goal was always to have a consistent group of people who felt comfortable with each other, who wanted to nourish each other and the work. A core group of people working together, creating a body of work, a resident playwright, uh, director, actors. One of the most amazing things about having a, a group of people in a company that you work with who you're comfortable with is that you know how to speak to each other. As I watch rehearsal and as I speak to actors during the rehearsal process and directors, they tell me things about my play that I hadn't realized. You can have Sarah walk around the whole space in a world on the edges. Oh my God, oh, Laurie. take this off. We're going to burn. Part of the mission of Elixir Productions Theatre Company is to present queer work. What, what kind of behaviors are expected of us in the world that we live in and what does it mean to dance outside of those? expectations. The company is about women also, because we do not hear their voices enough. So something beyond coming out stories, beyond two characters falling in love, beyond, beyond a lot of the tropes. The name of the company has to do with the elixir of life. Take a drop of this and you'll get a little bit younger. You'll know a little bit more. It's a way to heal. I think we've wanted to heal the audience too. So if anyone ever looks at you like you're a freak, if anyone ever does anything to try to take a piece of your dignity or anything else that's rightfully yours, here's what you do. You say to yourself, I have nothing to be afraid of. The wonderful thing about the New York International Fringe Festival is that it's, it's one of the only affordable ways to put up a show in New York, if you're an independent company, if you don't have like major financing. It's also a place where you can get your show up for five days in New York and you can possibly get someone in the theater to see your show and take it to the next level. It's the story of You're in Town, essentially, a play that started in Fringe and went all the way to Broadway. So it's a dream. It's part of the American dream. You're going to find theater that you may not find anywhere else. Uh, you can take risks at Fringe. Even in an affordable scenario like Fringe, there's still a lot of expenses that go along with producing a show independently in New York. Advertising budget, a marketing budget, uh, there are fees involved, obviously, for the house. We would also very much, very much, like to pay our actors and everyone who is involved in the show on a rehearsal to rehearsal basis. So everyone who's there in the rehearsal space, which is eight people, and that brings our fundraising goal total to $3,500. It's still a lot out of pocket for a small independent theater company like Elixir Productions. We would be so grateful for your help because your help lets us do things that really established theater can't always do. We have the opportunity, because we're so small, to take risks and to make work that 
is as ambitious as we are, and we're a really ambitious group of people, and we know we can do more with your help. And thank you so much.